And Shazim, I know this wasn't addressed to me, but uh, uh, hopefully you find this uh, question useful, um, or at the very least the possibility of dialogue on the subject interesting and edifying. Uh, first, your question and uh, your statements regarding pluralism and the necessity of flexibility of religious thought in a society. Absolutely agreed. But in looking at these questions of regional politics, of culture, of religion, um, and of how these differing forces interplay and ultimately impact individual human life and human events at the global scale, it seems curious to me, or at the very least interesting, that time and time again, um, when there is reference to a particular region, the immediate association is religious and often exclusively religious. Now, um, this is not to say that, that, you're, that you're doing this, um, more that I think uh, this is a concern which you are, uh, this is another side of the concern that you're expressing that we tend to polarize the world in religious categories. We tend to describe countries by religious associations, especially countries the individual history and culture of which we may ourselves be unfamiliar with. We tend to, when we don't know much about a country, assess it according to a religious affiliation, whether or not that religious affiliation is universal within the country. So it, it seems to me that along with this pluralism, maybe, maybe another aspect of the solution is to get both national identity and um, the way that individual people think of national identity um, separate from religion. Not that religion isn't a part of it, not that religion is not a part of cultural identity, but rather that it is a part of cultural identity and not a substitute for cultural identity. I think this would go a long way to fostering the sort of international understanding, understanding across theological lines and especially understanding across cultural lines, linguistic lines, that is absolutely necessary for getting people working together effectively on resolving our shared problems. So um, I'd be curious to hear your thoughts on this. Um, for that matter, I'd be uh, curious to uh, curious to hear anyone's thoughts on this. So, cheers.